We've heard stories about crumbling roads, bridges and buildings, not the kind of problem you want to discover after the fact. A local startup believes its technology can take safety inspections to a new level and along with it, public safety. CTV's Colton Weens has more on the software and where it's already being used. Because we can't keep up. Uh, if you simply Google search structural failure, uh, unfortunately it happens way too often. It's an issue that Albert Mansour and his team of civil, computer and artificial intelligence engineers are trying to tackle. And it's not a function of lack of inspection, it's actually a function of lack of available inspectors. How to better inspect major infrastructure like roads, bridges and buildings. That's why he created Cone Labs, an engineering grade platform that uses AI and 3D modeling to catch things the naked eye might miss. What we are building couldn't be imagined more than two years ago. To process imagery, make a 3D model, find defects in three dimension, the level of compute required frankly didn't exist. Here's how it works. Pictures are taken using a phone or a drone, the images are turned into a 3D model, and AI analyzes every aspect of what it sees. It allows us to just keep up. So today, if you look up bridge inspection, we're shutting down lanes of highways, we have folks rope accessing. So all of that is a very resource intensive, time consuming task. Since its inception, Communitech has helped connect Cone Labs with the city of Kitchener, who launched a pilot project using the technology and has used it to look at two bridges and one road. You know, you're always skeptical about new technologies and how you can use it. But what we've seen so far is we are, it's built our vision of what we can do and how we can analyze these structures. While the pilot project has only used the technology for the two bridges and here at Aaron Brook Drive, the city says it sees the potential for it and how it could be used more in the future. We've seen it, we're excited, and we're already looking into the future. So we have what can be. This is really allowing us to see what can be as we move forward in the future. While the city is using it just as a pilot now, Cone Lab says it's targeting other municipalities and engineering firms as they continue to grow to try and find simpler, safer, and faster solutions to inspecting. Colton Weens, CTV News, Kitchener.